what's hot at OSC. Um, so really exciting show, really great to be back in person and face to face and meeting with colleagues and customers. Um, for Nokia, one of the things we're really excited to see on the show floor, um, one of the hot topics um, fits in with our scale made simple theme for optical networking. And one of those key themes is in enabling new architectures. And this whole area of IP over DWDM has popped up on the radar again, with the key enabler being the availability of 400 ZR and ZR plus optics. And what's really interesting about this is looking at, okay, how can this enable us to drive more uh, power efficiency, space savings, cost savings in network architectures? Now, having said that, I would say primary use case we're seeing for that is within the, hyper, uh, within the hyperscale market. Um, hyperscalers, very specific application, very specific requirements, and definitely they see the path to introducing these optics to enable them to drive more efficiency, again, more power efficiency, space efficiency, and also operational and, uh, and other aspects as well. So very, very clear use case for these optics in that application. But what I've noticed at the show in talking with service providers in, in different areas of the network is their requirements are a little bit different. So um, they have different types of services, perhaps more complex architectures, and also um, differing operational requirements. So into this environment, Nokia is introducing at the show its new solution called coherent routing. And coherent routing is centered around the power is enabled with 400 ZR, ZR plus, and moving forward, 800 ZR, ZR plus optics, but it's more than just the optics. So as part of the overall solution, looking at the routers, and we have routers that are designed and optimized for managing these coherent optics. Um, they require higher power. There's uh, issues that you need to mitigate in terms of power dissipation and cooling. Um, so our routers are optimized for that. In addition to that, bringing in application optimized solutions for the line systems element. So if you're point to point, simple photom architecture may do, or you may have rotoms and other requirements as well. So we can bring in the right line system for the right application. And then tying it all together, operations is key. How do you operate, manage, operate, control, automate your IP and optical network architectures? So we roll those things together in addition to the optics in our coherent routing solution. So really pleased to be showing that at the event and uh, really hearing a lot of buzz in that area today.